going a lot. Uh, we've practiced summer practice, practice without even summer, just at the track field, going through ours every day, just trying to get better. Okay. Obviously, the passing games uh, come up big in a lot of games this season. How, how more confident, I guess, are you in it and kind of in your ability this year than in years past? I'm a lot, I'm a lot more confident uh, with the receivers in the line, just knowing they're going to give me time to give it to the playmakers of the team. They're going to do what they need to do. Okay. And kind of uh, obviously now you guys are going up against the, you know, a pretty big uh, challenge in Christchurch. What do you think should be the base, you know, key for you, especially if it comes down to, you know, where you guys are uh, against an offense like that where you guys might have to, you know, pass the ball a lot? Yeah, I just got to stay, stay composed, stay comfortable. Don't panic, no panics. Just do what I do best. Okay. Uh, what have you done just in terms of yourself just to kind of uh, elevate your game, just in passing game, just, you know, anything you've worked on in the offseason, anything like that? Just work. Just go over routes. Watch a lot of film on other quarterbacks that may be better than me, that know what they're doing, and learn from them. Okay. Uh, how, how many games did it take you to really kind of feel comfortable in the passing game just this year? I mean, did you start to feel it, you know, from the beginning, or did it take a few I games? Felt, I felt it during 7-on-7 seven seven season when we were out there beating everybody, really. Nobody could really stop our offense in 7-on-7, seven seven, so I got my confidence really from there this season. I know you had a big game against Ladder, you know, a lot of touchdown passes there. How much did that kind of raise your confidence kind of going forward that, as well? That boosted my confidence a whole lot. That was a big game for us. And, uh, and uh, that was a statement game for us in our mind. 